Alright guys, I got another. I'm just so excited to make this. So I have a root blend. This is a combination of beets, carrots, parsnip, and sweet potato. So I'm going to bake them and this is what it looks like. So, see the beets up there? Love, love that. Love, love that. And I think uh, the parsnip. Uh, carrots. Which I love this packaging right here because, you know, um, there's a lot of carrots in it actually. And I'm going to bake them. My, my baba doesn't really like beets. But I'm telling you, every time I make this, bake them, he won't notice it. And he'll say like, did I eat beets? Yeah, you did because it's a magic from me. <laughs> so, but anyway, so I have, I have actually, I'm gonna make three packaging of this. That's how I love it. So we're going to add our fennel seeds, paprika, parsley, chili powder, basil. And we are going to drizzle them with a good, decent quality of olive oil. I love this olive oil. This is so good. And I just started using an olive oil about two, three years ago. And I'm telling you guys, I love them. I love them. So every time I saute something, you know. So, But anyway, so I'm going to pour all my vegetables and i'm gonna show you how to put all the seasonings okay look at this i got huge pans <laughs> of this wonderful vegetables okay so just okay so what we're going to start on is drizzle with olive oil a lot of olive oil see that guys that goodness right there okay and after that to we'll add it a little bit more later okay then i'm gonna add our fennel seeds i love this fennel seeds this adds the flavor the aroma of this is good okay Oh, our fennel seeds, our paprika, a lot of paprika, a lot of paprika, and we will mix it up afterwards, okay? Ooh, yeah. oh, our parsley, parsley! I always have parsley in my pantry. I know sometimes I like to have a fresh one. But every once in a while, I always have a... Uh, not every once in always. But I mean, every once in a while, I get a um, fresh parsley. But it's just easy to get bad. So I always have a backup in my pantry to have a dry parsley you know and of course chili powder and things like that and this is the basil i love these combinations of herbs perfect okay so what we're going to do is just mix them up guys okay i'm using a glove so you can massage them so good I love the beets look at that the beets it starts coloring our beautiful parsnip parsnip okay so we are going to put it in our oven and our oven is preheated for 400 degrees Ooh, hot knee, hot knee, hot knee. So we are going to bake them for like 25 to 30 minutes, guys, okay? 